My name is Susan. I'm the Education Coordinator here at Los Flores Ranch Park with the City of Santa Maria. I'm also a California naturalist and I'm here to tell you about Los Flores Ranch Park and how wonderful it is to come out here, take in the nature, and enjoy some of the programs that we have to offer. So come on with me and let's check it out. Los Flores Ranch Park is nestled in the Solomon Hills just south of Santa Maria and has more than 1,700 acres of mature oaks, chaparral, grass-filled valleys, and seasonal wetlands. The city of Santa Maria purchased this property from an oil company in the early 2000s to be used as a future landfill and for recreational purposes and open space. Los Flores was open to the public in 2009 with eight miles of old roads used as trails. But there has been plenty of change at the ranch since then. Los Flores now has 16 miles of sustainable trails that offer views and vistas of the Santa Maria Valley, Sierra Madre Ridge, and the Guadalupe Dunes all the way to the Pacific Coast. These trails are open to hikers, mountain bike riders, horseback riders, and dogs are welcome on a leash. There are varying degrees of ease in our trails for those who prefer a leisurely walk or a more challenging hike. There are picnic tables and restrooms available throughout the ranch, so you can enjoy a comfortable afternoon here. Don't forget to bring your own water. With more than 16 miles of trails, you will find some are wide old trails and some are single track trails. There are some flat trails, but many have slight to steep inclines with an elevation reaching 1,200 feet. There are trails for all fitness levels. A popular trail for families and an easy walk at one mile is the Dinosaur Trail and Loop. Children will discover replica bones of a T-Rex that they can play on, using their imagination and connecting with nature. Continue on through the Dinosaur Loop and it will take you on a gentle walk through California's classic Chaparral. A more advanced trail at four miles is the Solomon Trail, which weaves through coast live oak trees and leads hikers to the Ridgetop Trail. This is well worth the time for the spectacular views of both the Santa Maria Valley and the Santa Ynez Valleys. From there, you have a choice of several trails based on your skill level. To continue on the four mile loop, you head down Rim Trail and head towards the Visitor Center. Los Flores Ranch Park offers a variety of activities and classes for youth and adults. Our native plant garden explores both the unique natural history of the Central Coast, but also the numerous uses of the plants that were used by the Chumash Indians. Kids and adults love our educational domestic animal area where the city of Santa Maria has adopted brews and sponsored goats, a lamb, a horse, and chickens. Los Flores Ranch Park also offers a variety of regular events and group activities including yoga, twilight and moonlight hikes, mountain bike rides, horseback rides if you have your own horse, archery, geocaching with more than 35 geocaches placed throughout the ranch, stargazing, bird watching and walks, mini ranch day with all things mini horses, nature walks, solar cooking, tailgate movies, and so much more. Most of our programs are free, but there may be a minimal charge for some. You must sign up and register for activities on the City of Santa Maria's active registration program through our city office or online at cityofsantamaria.org. Los Flores Ranch Park is also a great destination for school field trips and programs. We offer free nature programs and outdoor learning programs, including recycling. Our outdoor programs follow many K-5 through curriculums. We offer a Coast Live Oak Tree program, and we are always looking for schools, groups, and organizations that would like to help with acorn collection through the months of September and November. We need seed starting and germinating and oak tree planting. Most of our programs, field trips, and activities are led by a dedicated group of trained docents. Without them, we would not be able to offer the variety of programs and activities available at Los Flores Ranch Park. We are always looking for additional volunteers and docents, so join our team. 
Los Flores Ranch Park is home to several unique and fascinating habitats and species of plants and animals. While hiking through the park, you will move through California chaparral, grasslands, oak woodlands, and seasonal creeks. The primary tree at the property is iconic coastal live oak. A rare plant here is the La Parisma manzanita, which grows in this area all the way through Lompoc. We do have poison oak, so please do not touch it and stay on the trail to avoid it. Remember, leaves of three, let it be. The spring season at the ranch includes the bloom of beautiful wildflowers, such as the California poppy, shooting stars, buttercups, fiesta flowers, peonies, lupins, ceanothus, and so much more. And a favorite among our visitors are the many animals that call Los Flores home. If you are lucky, walk softly and keep your eyes peeled. You may have the opportunity to see bobcat, coyote, deer, badger, striped skunks in the evening, raccoon, opossums, feral pigs, jackrabbits, and desert rabbits. Watch for birds as small as the Anna hummingbird to as large as the golden eagle. We have regular sightings of the roadrunner and the California quail, our state bird. On the reptilian side of things, you may see the horned toad, gopher snake, or a California king snake. Remember, if you are lucky enough to spot wildlife, please let them be. You can make a loud noise and back away if you are intimidated, but never turn and run. Chances are they are more afraid of you than you are of them. We are also lucky to enjoy collaboration with local scout troops, church groups, schools, and other volunteers who have helped us preserve the important natural habitat and improve the park. As part of the Eagle Scout projects that have been done here at the ranch, we have bluebird boxes, owl boxes, trails, kiosks, program areas with benches, raptor perches, and Girl Scouts have been building on our native garden sign and plantings. We are always looking for more scout projects to improve and benefit our wildlife at Los Flores Ranch Park. If you are a City of Santa Maria resident or business owner, access to the ranch is free. Also access for those 65 and older, active military, and veterans is free. Non-city residents that do not meet the conditions for free access will have a minimal fee or can pay a yearly access fee. During the COVID-19 pandemic, the City of Santa Maria has waived the access entrance fee. A few rules worth mentioning. All visitors must register, check in and out. There's no smoking or fireworks. Los Flores is for day use only. And lastly, please stay on the designated trails and keep your dogs on a leash. Los Flores Ranch Park is open Thursday through Sunday, and our spring summer hours are 8 a.m. to 7 p.m., with the last entry at 6 p.m. Our fall and winter hours are 9 a.m. to 5 p.m., with last entry at 4 p.m. The main entrance into the ranch is located at 6271 Dominion Road, Santa Maria, California. Equestrian entrance from Santa Maria is through the 101 freeway south and the 161 exit. Make a left under the bridge and then a right and you will see directions for the parking area. Equestrians must call first, 805-938-7618, Thursday through Sunday. Recorded information is available at 805-925-0951, extension 29. Eight, five. More information is also available at the city website, cityofsantamaria.org, or the Los Flores Ranch Park Facebook page. Well, you can see how Los Flores Ranch Park is a wonderful natural and civic resource for Santa Marians and other Central Coast residents. We hope you come on out, take in the natural beauty, take in a deep breath, and enjoy and clear your mind out on the trail. Hope you come and visit soon. Bye.